Hendricks County. Well, classes are canceled for an entire Indiana school district as the coronavirus continues spreading. Avon Community School Corporation is closed for the next two weeks after one student tested positive for the disease and another is showing symptoms. And today we're learning how Tippecanoe County's public school corporation leaders are preparing. News 18's Micah Upshaw tells us how. If it happens, we're ready. Tippecanoe County schools have a plan in place as the number of coronavirus cases continues increasing in Indiana. We're continuing to monitor the situation. We're staying in constant communication with our school nurses, with officials from the county health department. Uh, we have regular team meetings. The superintendents agree that communication is key, especially when it could mean shutting down an entire school district. Avon Community School Corporation is offering e-learning for students. Tippecanoe School Corporation Superintendent Scott Hanback says this is a likely scenario if a student were to contract the disease here. Our middle school and high school students have take-home devices and our elementary level it might look a little bit different. So we have some experience doing this. When the tornado hit Mintani and Southwestern several years ago, there were several days where we delivered an alternative instructional model. The superintendents say they plan to react on a case case basis, but for now they're preaching good hygiene and upping their sanitation methods. We've just purchased foggers that will go into all of the classrooms and give a little bit more deep cleaning at a quicker pace and they're CDC certified. None of the school districts plan to cancel public events such as school dances, sporting events and other gatherings at this time. Lafayette Superintendent Les Huddle says they're taking it day by day. We, we want to make sure we're prepared, and then if there is a case, we kind of know what to do. In Tippecanoe County, Micah Upshaw, News 18. Well, the superintendents say they plan to continue meeting frequently with one another.